Hi everyone, welcome to the ML Hub. We have released the entire Gate DA course schedule along with the test series schedule on the website. So if you go on our website, themlhub.ai, uh, on the top right corner, you will see a link, Gate DA course schedule. If you click on this link, you will see the schedule that we're going to follow as a part of the course that we are offering for Gate DA 2026. Okay, so we will cover all the syllable, uh, uh, the entire Gate DA syllabus uh, like this uh, in detail. So we will start with probability and statistics and we are starting it from April 13th. So which is this Sunday, we will have the first session, which is just an introduction and outline session. I will take the probability and statistics subject. So I will tell you for this particular subject, how you need to learn, how you can like uh, visit the lectures, how to write down your doubts, how to ask them in the live session and so on. So the introduction and outline session is happening on April 13th. And from then the learning starts and probability and stats, uh, statistics will get over on May 18th, okay? So the first subject, which is probability and stats, will take five weeks. And we have divided all the subjects into modules, okay? Probability and stats contain six modules, counting, probability, statistics, uh, discrete random variables, continuous random variables, and statistical inference. And we will cover these six modules in five weeks. So for every week, detailed like the content that you need to cover, and the lecture numbers which you need to see. The recorded lectures are already there for the entire uh, syllabus. Okay, So you can watch the particular lecture numbers which are mentioned here uh, for that particular week. And we will have uh, the live doubt solving session and practice session at the end of the week. So for example, for week one, you need to study uh, these lectures. There are 11 lectures in total. And we will have the discussion session on April 20th, okay, which is the next Sunday. So this is the schedule that we're going to follow for the course and it is going to update live. It is like uh, open for everyone. If you are, even if you're not a registered student, you can check the schedule. And this is the same schedule that we will follow for the test series as well. So I told you in the test series, right? Like you will get topic tests, subject tests, and then multi-subject tests and grand tests for the entire course, right? So for every week, we will have one topic test. And we will not discuss the question of topic tests in the live classes because like they are tests and everyone needs to attempt them at their own pace. So for, for test series, the detailed solution for every question will be provided after the test ends on the portal itself. If you still have doubts, you can discuss them in the live session or on the discord server that we have. But uh, you, you need to attempt the test first. Okay. And the detailed solution will be provided on the platform itself. So the practice that we're going to do on the live session will be different from the test series. Okay. They are like different practice questions from that week's content. Cool. So this is the schedule for probability and stats. Immediately after probability and stats, we will start calculus, then artificial intelligence. Then we will see pro uh, programming and DSA, then linear algebra, uh, then machine learning. And at the end, we have DBMS and warehousing. Okay. So we have already mentioned all the modules and the entire schedule on this sheet and the syllabus is expected to end on November 9th, which is first week of November. So we will finish the syllabus till then and wherever in this schedule you see the entire subject thing. So it is, it is saying that the subject test will like arrive on this date. So let me tell you the test series schedule, how it works. So when you're studying in week one, the discussion session is going to happen on April 20th, right? Before that, the topic test will be live. Ideally, you should attempt the test after you have visited all the lectures and you have uh, attended the live session, which is the discussion session and the practice session, right? After everything is done, you can attempt the test. But before this only, like before the discussion date, the topic test will be live. So this is the schedule uh, we are going to follow for the test series as well. Okay, so this includes the course schedule and the test series schedule both. Similarly, for the subject test, uh, before the entire subject ends, which is May 18th, the subject test for uh, probability and statistics will be live. Okay. Now this sheet right now uh, doesn't contain anything after November 9th. So in November and December, we will release the multi-subject test and the uh, full syllabus test. Okay. So like the, those two months, uh, November, December and January actually. So for three months, we will do revisions, uh, revision uh, sessions and then we will release the schedule for multi-subject tests and uh, full syllabus tests as well. Okay. And we will personally take some uh, live sessions for revision as well for every subject in those three months. So this is how we're going to go. And uh, a common doubt with that, that we are getting is aptitude is not mentioned here. 
so for aptitude right now we have not planned uh, uh, live sessions but if students are facing doubts and uh, if live sessions are needed we will add them in the schedule uh, as and when needed but for aptitude the content is already there on the portal and the test series is also already live on the portal okay so yeah that's all like that's all about the schedule how to access it so the first class that we're gonna have is on april 13th which is an introduction and outline session for probability and statistics and after that like week one is going to end on april 20th so when you like for one week you will watch all this content and we will have a discussion session and practice session on april 20th so this is the schedule guys everyone can follow it even if you are not learning with us, if you are following some standard textbooks and resources, we have already provided a video on this channel which says like which textbooks you can refer uh, for the course and you can sh like see the schedule and still follow it on your own. Uh, this schedule contains detailed bifurcation which is not even mentioned in gate DS syllabus for every topic that you need to learn. Okay, so just follow the schedule and uh, let's crack gate uh, like happy learning. Bye bye.